welcome home. Yo, what's going on YouTube? A box here, and it might be a little bit too early for this speculation, but why not do it anyway? So, could we be seeing another standalone Fallout game about two years after Fallout 4 is released this year in 2015? So, I'm talking 2017, we could be seeing another Fallout game. Now, if you guys don't know, we had a standalone Fallout game in 2010 after the 2008 release of Fallout 3, and that was Fallout New Vegas. So what I want to hear from you guys down in the comment section below, do you think we could be seeing another standalone game, or do you think that was a one-time thing in between Obsidian and Bethesda? Now, we don't have to see it by Obsidian, but we could be seeing it by Obsidian. Could it be another development team, or do you think it would be Obsidian? Now, if you guys don't know, Bethesda and Obsidian kind of had a small falling out between each other, mainly because they had a deal where if they got a certain score for Metacritic or whatever like that, then they would get a bonus payment for the game. And they were something like 1% below that, and Bethesda didn't pay them the bonus. Now, that's a really small falling out, it's not really that big of a deal from my point of view, but it could have been a really big deal to Obsidian, and it could have really destroyed their relationship. But I'm not quite sure where their relationship is at this point, but I want to know from you guys, do you think we could be seeing another standalone game, or do you think that was a one-time cash grab kind of thing from Bethesda? We haven't seen any standalone games from the Elder Scrolls, and that's kind of just been a Bethesda thing every few years, or every, like, decade, basically. So, I want to know from you guys, do you think it was a one-time cash grab kind of thing, or do you think we could actually be seeing another follow game in about two years on the creation engine, on the same engine, by another development team such as Obsidian. Because what I'm expecting is that they're gonna wanna use this new updated creation engine for Fallout for more than one game. I don't expect them to use it for just Fallout 4 because it is an updated version of a Fallout engine and I don't see them doing all this massive updates to the creation engine just to only use it for Fallout 4. So, could we be seeing a standalone in about two years? I want to know from you guys your thoughts down in the comment section below because I think that we could possibly be seeing another follow game within the next two years that's a standalone from another development team. And honestly, it wouldn't really surprise me very much. However, that's actually it for this video. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys are enjoying all the follow four videos, go ahead and smack that like button down below and subscribe to join the good fight if you haven't already. It would be super greatly appreciated. But until next time, this is Epoxy signing off.